Hello William, this is Tom Murphy from Tom Murphy Menswear in Cork. We said we'd make a short instructional video to give you some ideas about the different styles of tails that you can wear um, for your wedding. Um, I hope uh, it is of some help to you. Starting with the black morning tail coat. This is a lightweight black coat which generally is worn with a grey striped trousers called the morning trousers. Now if you wish you can also wear it with a plain black trousers but this is normally the combination that we recommend over here. Silver waistcoat, silver tie, which is optional. Obviously this can be changed to any colour you want. You can put it with a white waistcoat or an ivory waistcoat. Just brought out an ivory waistcoat to show you because generally speaking men will try to match, grooms will try to match the bride. So if the bride is wearing an ivory waistcoat, generally the groom will wear an ivory waistcoat as well. Now we do this waistcoat in a plain ivory or you can also have it with something with a stripe in it. So the groom can go for a stripe and the rest of the lads can go for a plain ivory. As you can see that will sit very effectively inside a black tail suit. Um, we also do all these combinations in shorter length jackets, so if you want to give the um, fathers of the bride or groom or some of the older members of the party a shorter jacket, there's no problem doing that. We'll just move this guy to the side for a moment and we will show you the navy tail coat, which is this heavier style than the black. It's a herringbone, very subtle stripe that you might not be able to make out on camera but it is equally popular. It comes with a matching trousers. Now you can also wear it with a striped trousers, but generally speaking, this would be worn with a matching trousers. Here you see it with a purple cravat as opposed to a tie, which was on the previous mannequin. Um, now what grooms usually do is they go for the all ivory or the all silver. And if the lads want to match the bridesmaids, and for instance, if they're purple bridesmaids dresses, then you can go for something like the purple inside the suit. Again, this is available in a short suit. In fact, what we have next to it is the shorter version of it. So if you wish to combine the different outfits, if you want to go for a long jacket and a short jacket, there is no problem doing so. Um, finally, we have a grey morning tails, which is very popular at the moment. Oops, I think his hand just fell off. Grey herringbone tails, same as the navy, it's a slightly heavier fabric and a slightly heavier quality. Um, pure wool in matching trousers, here we have it with a buff grey waistcoat and a grey striped tie. Worn with a white shirt in this case, now if the bride's dress is ivory, generally speaking we would go for an ivory shirt inside it. Um, we'll just move him to the side. So very quickly, we said we'd give you a quick run through the different combinations of suits. If you have any further questions or if you need to ask me anything, feel free to email me or phone the store and we can have another chat um, and I have no problem making another video. Uh, thank you and enjoy your time over in Australia. Bye bye.